Hey, Big V here, and we are talking teams. Today in my series of Ogmandino's greatest salesmen in the world, I'm going through each of the 10 scrolls. Today, I wanna to talk about scroll number four. Scroll number four is titled, I am nature's greatest miracle. And I want you to think about the words that Ogmandino shares as he talks about your value in the marketplace. He says, I am nature's greatest miracle. Since the beginning of time, there has never been another with my eyes, my hands, my hair. None that came before and none that come after can walk and talk and move exactly like me. All men are my brothers, but I am unique for I am nature's greatest miracle. Think about where that comes from. How many of you actually believe that you're a son or daughter of God and that God doesn't make mistakes? And that means that your potential is whatever you want it to be. You have unlimited potential. And I love that Ogmandino points that out in a sales book called The Greatest Salesman in the World. What he's basically saying is he says that we're all different and that's what's beautiful about you individually is you are unique and you are different and you are special. He says this and I want you to think about these words. He says, I am nature's greatest miracle and I'm not here by chance. I am here for the purpose and that purpose is to grow into a mountain, not shrink into a grain of sand. Henceforth, I will apply all of my efforts to become the highest mountain of all and I will strain my potential until it cries for mercy. Understanding that you're the offspring of greatness, that you have unlimited potential, are you straining your potential until it cries for mercy? Are you getting up every day and pushing yourself beyond what you believe is possible because anything is really possible? Here's some of the things that Ogmandino talks about and how to do it. And he gives you a roadmap, a specific series of activities. He says, I will increase my knowledge of mankind and myself and the goods that I sell and the cells will multiply. Now, I want you to just stop and I'll pause on that for a sec. So I will Take a moment and I will increase my knowledge of mankind. How do you do that? You start becoming interested instead of interesting. You start listening to understand instead of listening to respond. A great quote I heard from Dave Blanchard, CEO of Ogmandino, as he was teaching people to have better relationships. He said, listen to understand, not to respond. And that has stuck with me in every interaction and communication that I have. Ogmandino says that I will practice and improve and polish the words that I utter to sell my goods, for this is the foundation foundation on which I will build my career. And never will I forget that many have attained great wealth with only one sales presentation delivered with excellence. Now, think about that. Each Thursday, as a Workman Success client, you have the ability to come in and participate in our role play calls, where we practice our scripts and our dialogues over and over again. We might practice one of the shift modules, or we might practice how to get more appointments, or what to say in open houses. Regardless of what it is we're practicing, we just practice it over and over and over again, so that when we're in the situation with a client that gives us an objection, or tells us they're thinking about another agent, or wants us to reduce commissions, we have very specific scripts and dialogues that teach Teach us how to give more value instead of reducing our price. We always want to do the right thing and practicing makes a difference. He said, I will seek constantly to improve my manners and graces for they are the sugar which all are attracted. All of this because I am nature's greatest miracle. When I think about being nature's greatest miracle, oftentimes people ask us, well, how much should I charge? And the answer to that is that we charge for the value we provide. There's no set fee that you should charge as a buyer's agent or a listing partner when you're dealing with commissions. And so everything is negotiable. And I want you to understand that you should charge a fee based on the services you provide, not the number of hours that it takes. Let me give you an example. As a team leader, we have the ability to put our buyer's agents and listing partners in a situation where they sell more homes. And so people always ask, how much should I pay a buyer's agent? Well, just like you are nature's greatest miracle, they are too nature's greatest miracle. And we treat them based on who they are and what it is they want to accomplish. Would it be fair to say that I want everybody on my team to make more on my team, even though they're on a lower split, they would make individually doing it by themselves. And we do that by putting them in the right situation. So with a buyer's agent, let me give you a buyer's agent compensation. As a team leader, you've heard me say it before, that your responsibility is to create stability and security for your team. And you should run your business at a 50% gross profit after your cost of sale. So you can't pay a buyer's agent 50-50 and then have all the expenses because now you're running on a 12 or 13% net profit. It doesn't work. So we pay buyer's agents 40% split on the first two transactions they do in a month. 
they get 45.55 on deals three and four, and then 50.50 on five plus. And then it resets every month. The minimum level of acceptable performance for a buyer's agent on a workman coach team is two transactions a month or 24 transactions a year. An agent in most markets will earn somewhere between 85 and $125,000 a year as a buyer's agent on the team, which is more than the average agent makes working by themselves. I am nature's greatest miracle means that you put yourself in a position where you have the opportunity to maximize the amount of money you earn. Not everybody wants to be a team leader. Not everybody wants to be a buyer's agent. But whatever role you choose, put yourself in the place where you get the highest return on time away from family. I'm going to wrap this scroll up by sharing with you the very last phrase of this scroll. And I'm going to give you the opportunity. You want to know how we actually do buyer's agents and what's in their contract? How about, I'm just going to give it to you. Right here in the link below, I want you to go down. I want you to download a copy of our buyer agent agreement that we use. Now, I recommend you get your own attorney. Just use it as an outline of what we do and how we create the job description and the compensation program and make sure that it's legal with your brokerage and in your state. And now I want you to apply it to this. He says, I am nature's greatest miracle and nature knows not defeat. Eventually, she emerges victorious and so will I. And with each victory, the next struggle becomes less difficult. I will win and I will become the greatest salesman the world has ever known. Good luck to you as you understand and apply the principles of I am nature's greatest miracle in your life.